All right, welcome back to the channel. Really excited today. We're going to cover a uh, application called the Demiki Rig. So, before we get into that, please go ahead, uh, go ahead, hit that like, smash that subscribe, follow us along, hit that notification bell, leave us a comment. We love to interact, but. Uh, here we are, we're trying to bring you the best content we can possibly build. Uh, we're getting better and we're trying our best. So with that, uh, let's jump right into it today. We're gonna cover the Demiki rig. So um, today I'm gonna basically show you how to uh, rig up your Demiki rig, show you kind of talk about how we uh, fish it and uh, maybe have any questions for us, let it, leave, us, leave us some in the comment and we'll be happy to cover or answer those at a later date. So with that, today I'm gonna to be rigging up the uh, Demiki's anchovy shad in a four inch. Uh, these are in the uh, blue, uh, pro blue, uh, some called uh, blue pearl. Uh, they're basically a, a, a clear white with a little bit of blue tint on the back. Really, really light, like baby blue color. Uh, and then we're gonna pair that up with the Pandia jig from none other than Demiki. There are a lot of Demiki style jig heads out on the market, but me personally, I like to use mine directly from Demiki. So uh, on the jig head itself, basically you got a, you know, a weighted uh, jig head with that 90 degree line tie at the top. That'll help keep that bait, uh, you know, really horizontal uh, when you're bringing it down through the water column and working it above, you know, above the bass. And then, uh, so all you're gonna do, you'll run it kind of basically like any other, uh, you know, swim bait, single swim bait type uh, application. You know, you're gonna run it straight to the tip of that uh, bait. You know, keep it nice and straight. That's the main thing to focus on is nice and straight. Because if you're off, it'll just make the, it'll make it tumble and twirl and, and everything else. And then on these Dominicans, they're just very small slip for, you know, it basically tells you where the hook should be coming out. Also helps you to keep it straight, right? Make sure we're doing just as I said. And then you're just gonna slide it down. Got a good, solid, built-in keeper on these, so these don't really slide a lot. Um, got that one pretty, pretty straight, actually. Uh, first shot, that's pretty, pretty great for me. So there you go. You kind of see it's nice and straight. And then uh, there it is sitting up on that jig head. And basically, there, there's about three different ways you can fish this. You can dead stick it, which is basically dropping it down above fish like on a pile or a rock and just sitting there and holding it and allow that it'll, you know, current, whatever, will move that boot tail around. And then the other way, is, you know, you can drop it all the way down to, uh, down the water column, all down the bottom. And once you hit the reach bottom, just kind of hop it along, it'll flutter up and it'll kind of twirl and, and dive back down. That's another way to fish it. And then the other way is to kind of what I call strumming it. Basically you want to cast out past the target and as it comes down the water column where you want it, you're just going to twitch and slowly reel the whole way back. Just twitch and, twitch and reel the whole way through real, real slow. Uh, and that'll keep it, you know, above, you know, but you want to be keeping it above those fish if you're seeing them on a live scope or whatever forward facing sonar you may be using. That'll help you uh, keep it above them because the fish want to feed up. Got a super good hook on these Demikis. Uh, Really can't go wrong. So uh, that's about it. That's, it's a very simple application, uh, but very deadly application. So if you haven't done it before, get out there and give it a shot. And if you have, I hope uh, hopefully this helps. If you have any questions or thoughts or maybe something I missed or not sure about, please leave us a comment. Uh, we'll get back to you and uh, hopefully answer any questions you may have or maybe should shoot some further future videos so that uh, we can answer anything you may have. But with that, please hit that like, smash that subscribe. It helps us out a ton. Thank you guys. Go, uh, go out there and stick you a big one. Fish on.